Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hoy nos falló Zaira, no se ha conectado. Es de las puntuales. Cierto, es cierto. Ya va a llegar. Los puntuales, perdón. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Teacher, alguien escribió que tiene una emergencia con su papá. Esto lo dice Mari. No sé qué es. Mari. Me conectaré como oyente. Ya vamos a ver quién es. Está de Raining, Santa Ana. Raining. Raining. Sí, en mi casa, todo muy fuerte, muy, muy, muy fuerte. Ok. Oh, that's good. What neighborhood? Today. In my house, no. Yes, today has been a really hot day. Right now, I feel very hot here. Oh, good for you. I would love to have some rain here. Cats and dogs. Cats and dogs, teacher. Raining cats and dogs. Yeah. Be careful with the floods. Today is International Dog Day. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's celebrate. Dog, dog, dog. Day, dog, day. Do you have a dog? Yes. Really? Oh. The proof. <laughs> What's his name? People. <laughs> People. People. Uh -huh. Ah. Okay. For for. Soccer. Ah, the soccer player. Yes, for soccer player. My brother, people. In, in Sagi. Your brother, what? In Sagi or in Sagi. Oh, people in Sagi from Italy. Yes. Oh, I thought that people. For, Pipo Rodriguez, it was a soccer player. Oh, from, no. From El Salvador, For, but in the 70s. Oh, no, my brother. For people in Sagi. Ah, okay. My mom is a Who else has a dog? My mom. 
my mom eat oh most of the alimenta a lot of street dog really yeah uh, oh mm. is she adopting them eh eh y eh, son fuera del negocio de ella pone un contenedor para que se estén alimentando oh alimenta como 20 diarios bueno llega antes empezaba llegó llegó uno dos después fueron llegando más eh, se le va más o menos dos sacos grandotes de comida semanal It's a lot of money a lot of money a but, lot of money but eh, eh, ¿cómo sería la bendición? ¿cómo? ¿cómo diría que la bendición es mayor? blessing the blessing is greater in this case because um, that Dios no se queda con nada yeah yeah that's true se le va el audio por ratos, Frida. Sí, que si quieren adoptar a un perro de, San, de, los, que, de los montones que alimenta ahí en San Marcos. Mm. Así que ahí están, ya llegan como 20 más diarios. Yo he contado todavía más. Desde las 6 de la mañana mm. ya están esperando para que para que le pongan comida cuando abren el negocio de ella. Ok, yeah. Interesting. Uh, we have a little dog. We have a little dog too. In my case, I like it, but I... It's a problem with my daughters and my wife. <laughs> They have allergies. Ah, oh. ok, yeah. It's nice. Teacher, I support you with your sharing Facebook today. What did I share? Um, si vende algo, ponga precio, no es adivinanza. Ah, yeah, that's true. I hate when people don't, don't say the price. I hate you it. Have my, you have my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, people, let's get it started tonight. We are going to continue practicing a little bit about past tense, okay? Simple past tense. So at the end of the day, I gave you some questions to practice. So I'm going to ask you one of these questions, okay? When did you last cry? When did you last feel really, really angry? When did you last forget to do something? When did you last have a fight with someone? And when did you last do something that made you very happy? Okay. Are you ready for this? Well, I don't hear a yes, but I will do it anyways. Let's start backwards today. Let's start backwards today with the attendance. Jocelyn Johanna Garcia never showed up. Rocio Lourdes Pimentel. Present. Hello, Rocio. How are you? Uh, very well. Very well? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. It's, it's good to have you in class again. Thank you, teacher. Uh, only, uh, bueno, solo comentarle, tengo a mi mamá un poco complicada de salud. Por eso oh. no me he podido conectar en esos días. Okay, okay. We hope she... She'll get, get get well soon, okay? Thank you. Okay. Um, if I ask you, Rocio, when did you last cry? Do you remember? 
just to practice. Um, yes, uh, the last Sunday. Last Sunday, oh. Yes. <laughs> Very near. <laughs> Can I ask you why? Um, uh, yes, uh, I heard I heard my my um my pie my foot and my foot. Oh, mm -hmm. oh. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Yes, now? yes. Ah, okay. Leave. The pinky toe. The yes. pinky toe. Oh. <laughs> okay, Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Hello, Mauricio. Hello, teacher. Um, may I ask you, when did you last feel really, really angry? I, I don't, I don't know, teacher. I... You don't remember? No. You don't get angry often? Oh. With frequency? Yeah. Sometimes? Yes. But you don't remember when was the last time? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, okay. Karen Vanessa Murataja. Hi. Hello, Karen. How are you? Barely hear you. Oh, sorry. Okay. Okay, okay, Karen. When did you last forget to do something? Um, I don't remember. <laughs> oh. In this time? Did yeah recently? Yes. No. I forget. Oh. <laughs> something yeah. <laughs> That you have to had to do, and uh, you didn't do it. I don't know. Pay a bill. Okay. For example, uh, this morning I was forget my keys in my house, and when I arrived to my house, I I not find my keys in my backpack. Ah, and how did you get into your house? Uh, when my sister arrived. You had to wait outside? Yes. Huh? One, Not... one hour. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good. Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Are you here? Yes. You're there. Present. Hello, Jacqueline. Hello. Let's see. I don't think you have ever done this, but I'm going to ask you. You look so calm, but when did you last have a fight with someone? You know what I mean? I'm not. A fight, an argument, a, dis a strong discussion maybe. Pelea. Yeah. When did you last have a fight with someone? Yes, I did. Um... Oh. <laughs> Look at her. Very sweet, but <laughs> she's a fighter. When? Two, two months ago. Two months ago. Oh, my. <laughs> Can you tell us why did you fight with that person? And who did you fight with? With ex-novio, como se dice? <laughs> the ex. Oh my God. What did he do? Um, I don't understand. What did he do? What did your boyfriend do? 
to fight with him. No, you don't get no. it? <laughs> okay, but you had a fight with him. I was asking, ¿qué hizo? Ah, ¿qué hizo <laughs> él? Huh? Don't, don't tell us, okay? Keep it for you, no problem. Okay, let's continue with Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Hello. Okay, Wendy. <laughs> when did you last do something that made you very happy? Uh, very happy. Yes. In last, last visit from brother's house because I saw my niece. Ah, okay, okay, very good. Let's go now with Syra Marleni Larin. Hello, teacher. Hello, Syra. May I ask you, when did you last feel really, really angry? Ah. I know angry nah. um, are you sure i don't think so very often when they wanted to treat they wanted to what you wanted to wanted to treat treat uh, my children badly Ah, who who wanted to treat bad your children badly? Yes. Who who wanted to treat your children badly? Quién quién me los? Uh -huh. Por qué me enojo? Uh, who? Um, the family, the my husband. Oh. Yeah, that's terrible. Uh, don't okay. touch my children. Ah, I get angry when they mess with my children. Okay, very good. Myra, Myra Veralice Moreno. Hi. Hello, Myra. Let me ask Hello. you. I don't, I don't think this happened to you, but when did you last forget? to do something? Mm, I don't remember. Mm. You don't remember? You mm. never forget? No. 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 You have a good memory? Ah, uh, yo creo. <laughs> ah, yes, okay. Yeah, you are you are very young. Okay, Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Mauricio Antonio Rivera, not here. Mare, Maria Ivania Palma. Maria Ivania. Not responding. Maria Concepcion here, here, Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> okay, Ivania. Uh, your question is, when did you last have a fight with someone? Have a fight. Um, um, <laughs> um I, I did, I did the fight in one, one Monday. Ah. One month. One month ago. Yes, uh, with my sister. <laughs> 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 is the normally. Yeah, that is normal. <laughs> that is very common. Fight with your brothers and sisters. 
I never had that problem. I never had that problem. <laughs> because I don't have brothers and sisters. That's why. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Concepcion, I think she's the one with this, her father uh, sick. Uh, Laura, Laura Carolina Vigil. Hi, teacher. Hello, Laura. So, when did you last do something that made you very happy? Um, when I went shopping. Hmm. Shopping, going shopping makes you very happy. Yes. <laughs> Every woman. <laughs> Every woman gets okay. happy okay. when they go shopping. Okay, Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Are Hi, teacher. Okay, Catherine. When did you last cry? <laughs> I don't know. I cry for everything. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah. When was the last time? Um, Maybe today. Oh, really? Why did yeah, you cry? My, my dog is a little sick. Oh, poor yeah, thing. Yeah, he is so thin. I'm so little and I think that maybe he has a, I don't know, dolor. Pain? A pain in his, I don't know, leg. Oh. Uh -huh. And I, I think uh, a, sentimental, a sentimental for this. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Good. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Jose Rodrigo? Not yet. Hey, Jose Jonathan Vigil. I present. Hello, Jonathan. When did you last feel really, really angry? Mm. Maybe on Sunday, last Sunday. Wow. When, wow. The, when the selecta lost. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I understand why. Galileo, Jose Galileo Barrera. Hi, teacher, good evening. Good evening. When did you last forget to do something? Today. Really? What did you forget to do? Yeah, I forget check and uh, perform uh, about one request to Papa John's International. Oh. I forget check it and I need to, to do it after this class. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. I'm here, teacher. Okay, Arnoldo, when did you last have a fight with someone? Today. Today? Oh, my goodness. What happened? I have a, a special group of cells. <laughs> and the maybe they don't are polite. Oh. And if they don't are polite, maybe I'm not. And oh. this is a problem, but it's a little fight. It's, it's, oh. como, como niño. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Hasta que hay sangre. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, okay, I got it. Okay, Javier Aldair Escobar. Hi, teacher. Uh, I am driving in the next moment. Um, turn on your camera to see. If that's good. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm teasing. No, be careful. Okay, okay. I'm gonna ask you later. Okay, Guillermo Antonio Garcia. 
Okay, Guillermo, when did you last do something that made you very happy? When, oh. uh huh. Oh. Oh, repeat, please. When did you last do something that made you very happy? Um. Uh, Sunday. On Sunday. Ah, okay. <laughs> what did you do? Um. Uh. Um, my friends, uh, me, um, uh, uh, watch movie in the cine. Movies, movie, uh, in the movies or the okay. cinema. Cinema. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Um, okay. eh, lo que pasa es que ya teníamos ratos de. De, de, de no vernos con mis buenos amigos, ¿no? Ah, ok. Ok, that's good, that's good. Ok, Frida Janine Mejía. Hello. Hello, Frida. Now, let's see. When did you last have a fight? Oh, no, no, it's not that for you. No, let's go to the first one. Let's go back to the first one. When did you last cry? Um, I cried about a year, I think. Uh -huh. uh, because I was going through a lot of stress at work because of the pandemic in this time, in this, in this moment. Ah, okay. That's terrible. Okay. Okay. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Hello, Dinora. By How the way, you? today's personal session is with you, Dinora. Okay. okay. At the end of the class. And your question is, when did you last feel really, really angry? Mm, I think every day. My goodness, no, really? No, Are you an angry didn't. person? Hmm? Are you an angry person? No. No. Se me pasa, rápido. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Brian Javier Carmona. Present teacher. Hey, Brian, when did you last forget to do something? Uh, Brian. Repeat, teacher. When did you last forget to do something? I do not remember. Really? You said, oh, I forget. No, no, teacher. Um, uh, something the work, the work. Uh huh. Maybe. Okay. Yeah, you are very young. You don't forget things easily. <laughs> okay. And finally, Ana Lilian Reyes. Present. Okay, Ana Lilian. When did you last have a fight? Uh huh. Uh -huh. Um. The weekend. Uh, the last weekend? La, the last weekend. Para esta semana pasada. The last week? The last week. Uh, feed with it. Those of uh, the company. Figo. Oh. Uh, they, the. <laughs> the Spoiler the internet. Ah, okay. You had a fight for that. Yeah, that happens. That's that's true. 
Okay, okay, very good. Thank you very much for responding, okay? Well, today we're going to continue talking about simple past. So let's see here. We're going to practice a little bit more about just no questions with simple past, okay? But let's read this paragraph. Uh, the objective is you will be able to ask customers questions or to confirm that they got what was promised. Hmm. Okay, we have two paragraphs here about Mrs. Mendoza and Mr. Torres. Two people describing their experiences with two different companies. Okay. Let me read the first one. This is Mrs. Mendoza. Okay. And she said, uh, let me get there. Mrs. Mendoza said, I had a problem with the payroll, with the payroll system, but a technician came to help me with it. He solved it, but he didn't say anything. He even charged me for a piece he broke. He gave me a copy of the report, but I didn't understand it. Besides all that, I forgot to mention that he came very late. Then Mr. Torres. I had a problem with the car's engine, so I called for assistance. The mechanic was really kind. He was there really fast and he was quick to fix my car's problem. He gave me details about the incident and he gave me a report of it. Then I started the engine and everything was perfect. Okay, now, uh, the first time, the first thing I want you to do I want you to read individually these two uh, paragraphs and circle all the verbs in past form, okay? So please go ahead, take your time and circle all the verbs in past form. For example, the first one, I had. This is one. I had a problem with the payroll system, but a technician came to help me with it. Please, I will give you five minutes to do this and we'll check together later. Go ahead, circle all the verbs in the past form. What page, teacher? It is page 33. Thank you. Oh, my water is very warm. Sabien tibia.
When you finish, please raise your virtual hand to know that you have already finished. I found 17. Did you did you do you have 17? <laughs> In the two paragraph. Yes. Oopsie. One, two, three, four. Oh, yes. Circle them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Just in the first paragraph, there are 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I found two more. Nine. Now I found 19. All the verbs in, in past form, all the verbs. In my case, 13. 13. Mm. Jacqueline, how many how many do you have? Please people count count them. Twenty teacher. Twenty. Wow, Arnoldo found twenty. One ten, more. Ten. Okay. Let me check again, Mrs. Mr. Torres. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
I only have nine at Mr. Torres. Oh my Aha, what about the rest? Rocio, how many how many did you find? Fifteen. Fifteen. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, Myra, how many did you find? Teacher. Yeah. Um, negative four. Is in past. Oh, okay. Ah. <laughs> Only um, past form. Only affirmative. Uh, oh, I okay, said past okay. form. Mauricio, how many do you have? ¿Cuántas dijo uh, que eran? I have nineteen, Wendy. I, uh, I have eighteen. Nine, eight? Eight, nine. Nine and nine. Nine and nine. Eighteen. Yes. Okay. Dinora, how many do you have? Nineteen, teacher. Excellent. Jacqueline, you didn't tell me. Sixteen. 16, there are three more, <laughs> at least. Arnoldo has, has 20. <laughs> 19. Oh, 19, okay. Um, uh, about the conjugation. Uh -huh. Okay. But 10 and nine. 10 and nine, yes. Teacher. Yep. Um, no sé si los demás, pero yo he tenido problemas en, el, en la tarea. Really? Incluso hice lo que casi no hago, hacer trampa en, en buscar en un traductor y todo, y no me pega de ninguna okay. forma. Give me the number of exercises and I will check later. Um, Two and four. What lesson? Um, Twelve. Um, Thirteen. Number. Four and five. Give me a moment. So lesson 12. Exercises. Two and four. Two and four. Lesson 13? No, 13 y 14, no me recuerdo exactamente los, los números, pero la, mm. quino, la 15 sí es 4 y 5. Lesson 15, 4 and 5. Okay, I'm going to check later and I'll let you know. Hey, people, come on. Just circle the verbs. Okay, let's check. The first sentence. I had a problem with the payroll system. Is there a verb? Uh, 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 okay. Uh, but a technician came to help me with it. Okay. He solved it, but he didn't say anything. Solved it. Solved it. Solved it. Solved it. And didn't. And didn't say. Didn't say. Yes. The verb is didn't say. Yes. Yes. Okay. Sorry. He didn't charge me for a piece he broke. Charged. 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 Charged.
And? Bro. Bro. Okay. He gave me a copy of the report, but I didn't understand it. Gave, gave, okay. and didn't understand. Didn't understand, okay. Besides all that, I forgot to mention that he came very late. Forgot and came. Forgot and came. Forgot and came, came. Forgot and came. correct. Then Mr. Torres, I had a problem with the car's engine, so I called for assistance. The mechanic was really kind. Was, was, really kind. was. He was there really fast and he was quick to fix my car's problem too. Was, 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 and was. was and was. He gave me details about the incident and he gave me a report of it. Gave, 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 and, gave. and gave. And gave. Then I started the engine and everything was perfect. Started. And was. And was. Ah, okay. Very good. Now you have two questions. Okay. Any question with the paragraph? Any? No question with the paragraph? Good. Now you have two questions here. Did Mrs. Mendoza have a problem? Is a method of payment? Did Mrs. Mendoza have had a problem? Oh, that sent that question is wrong. Yes, yes, teacher. Yes. Did Mrs. Mendoza have no have have a problem with a method of payment. Let me share the screen to correct that. Okay. I'm sorry for this material, but in support, it's in support material, so we have to use it. Okay, this is incorrect. Uh, let me browse it over. I had no. Did Mrs. Mendoza have okay a problem with a method of payment? Yes or no? No. Yes, teacher. Yes. No. 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 <laughs> Charge me. Oh, he gave me a copy of the report. Mm -hmm. Why do you think, Arnold, that he had a problem, she had a problem with a method of payment? The payroll system, the, she, she had a problem with the pay, uh, payroll system. This um, is a form to make the the method of payment. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that this is the, the problem. I don't, maybe I'm wrong. Well, if you if you mean to pay the workers, maybe yes. She had a problem with the payroll system. And the payroll system is the way to, mm -hmm. The payroll system um, is for payment. Yes, you're right. What is payroll? Can you 
Everybody knows what is planilla. Planilla. La planilla, verdad? So Mrs. Mendoza had a problem con la planilla. Is that a method of payment? Uh, yes. Okay, let's say yes. It's included. She did. Did Mr. Torres call his best friend for help? No. 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 No, he did. He no, didn't. He didn't. No, he didn't. No. Oh, who did he call? Assistant. Assistant. A technician. He called for assistant. Assistance. Uh, a mechanic. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, um, now let's take a look to this information about questions. These are the yes, no questions. Last night we saw a little bit about this, okay? Here we have more examples. Look, did you call the mechanic to check your car? Did she pay extra money? Did we receive a report? Did they sign the letter? Okay, if we want to write the structure for this kind of questions, what is the first thing in a yes, no question? What is the first thing? In a yes, auxiliary. no question. Auxiliary. Auxiliary. What auxiliary? Did. Did. Oh, come on. Did. What is next? The subject. 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 Okay. What is next? Verb in, Ver in base form. Verb in base form. Okay. Then finally, uh, complement. Okay. And a question and mark. Symbol. And a question mark. Question, question mark. mark. Question mark. Correct. Okay. You see? So, uh, um, I mean, deal, subject, verb. The base form, remember that in questions, the verb is in the base form and then the complement, okay? Then we have the short answers, the short answers, okay? Observe, in affirmative answers, well, in affirmative short answers, we never use contractions, okay? In affirmative short answers like these, yes, I did, yes, she did, yes, we did, yes, they did, we never use contractions. We can use contractions only in negative short answers. In negative short answers, we can use contractions. Okay, didn't, no, I didn't, no, she didn't, no, we didn't, no, they didn't. Okay? Always, always, teacher. Uh, no, 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 it's not mandatory. You can write the complete form. No, I did not. It's okay. Um, thank you. Okay, and you can use contractions. Okay, but in affirmative short answers, never use contractions. All right? <clears throat> okay, any question with this? No questions? Perfect. Now, we have an exercise here. 
we have the answers, you have to write a yes, no question, depending on the answer. For example, the first answer says, uh, yes, I did. I sent the email. What is the question? Did, did you send the email? Okay, did you send the email? That is the question, okay? Yes, I did. I sent the email. Continue with the other four. Please write the question for each response. Did they check the package? Okay. Si alguien quiere tomar el control para escribir la pregunta, me dice y se lo paso. Did they? Uh -huh. ¿La va a escribir? Did they check the package? Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, let me write it for you. I, I, I don't know how to write. Okay, we'll write it for you. They check the package. Good. How about number three? Did the car turn on again? Okay. Perfect. Number four. Did you receive a copy of the receipt? Did he buy a new tire? Sorry? Did he buy a new tire? Okay, very good. Okay, let's see. Let's practice these questions and answer, okay? Repeat after me. Turn on your microphones, please, and repeat after me. Did you send the email? Did you send the email? Did you send the email? Yes, I did. I sent the email. Yes, yes, I, I did. did. I sent the email. email. Did they check the package? Did, did they, they check, check the, package? the package? No, they didn't. They didn't no. check the package. No, they didn't. No, they, they didn't. didn't. They, they didn't check the package. Check the package. 
Did the car turn on again? Did the car turn on again? Yes, it did. The car turned on again. Yes, it did. The car turned on again. Did you receive a copy of the receipt? Did you receive a copy of the receipt? No, we didn't. We never received a copy of the receipt. No, we didn't. We, didn't. we, didn't. we, never, we never received a copy of the receipt. Did he buy a new tire? Did he buy a new tire? Yes, he did. He bought a new tire. Yes, yes he did. He bought a new tire. A new tire. Okay, very good. Any question here? No questions? Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, I'm confused the number two, the number four, and the subject no use the we, sino que you. Oh. Ya, yeah, porque usualmente si yo respondo nosotros, ¿cómo me hicieron la pregunta? Ah, uh, you de plural. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ustedes. ¿Verdad? Uh -huh. okay. Así como si eh, cuando me preguntan a mí, ¿verdad? De you hablando singularmente. Did you uh, receive a copy of the receipt? Tendría que ser no, I didn't. Si es singular, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Como la primera. Como la primera, correcto. Sí. Ah, ok. Así. Ah, Era mi duda. Ok. Thank you. Ok. I'm going to... Take the second attendance and then we're going to continue, okay? Ana Lilian Reyes Ulloa. Present teacher. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Uh, Brian Javier Carmona Escobar. Brian Javier Carmón Escobar. Present. Wake up, Brian. Dinora Alejandro Alfaro Corea. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Frida Janine Mejía de Celaya. Present, teacher. Thank you. Guillermo Antonio García Sánchez. Present. Good. Javier Aldair Escobar Morales. Present, teacher. Ajá, Javier me debe una pregunta o una respuesta, mejor dicho. Al final de la clase. Al final de la clase. A ver. Let's see this one. When did you last have a fight with someone? Fight. Javier, yes, a Uy. fight. Well, I passed it. I passed it, teacher. But, but um, maybe the last weekend. Um, oh, very passive. <laughs> maybe the last weekend I. I. Discussion, teacher. I had an argument. Como si se argument. I have an. I have argument with my partners because. I because yeah. I we see you the the el, the party soccer and the tele de la selecta versus Mexico y uh -huh. um tuvimos tuvimos roces I have the roses no sé cómo <laughs> okay you have a fight for the football uh, yeah okay yeah. Was, yes Traducido sí. roces es quick ponches con with blue. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, José Arnoldo Mazariego. 
Present, teacher. Thank you. Jose Galileo Barrera. Present. Thank you. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present. Thank you. Jose Rodrigo Hernández. Jose Rodrigo didn't show up today. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Thank you. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Thank you. Maria Concepcion Cerón. Not. Eh, Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. No, Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present. And Zaira Marlene Larín. Present. Thank you. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present, teacher. Eh, eh, María Concepción. Eh, problem. Uh, her father sick. Yeah, 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 that's right. Thank you. Uh, Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Present. Thanks. Uh, Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Good. Uh, Mauricio Antonio Rellana. Present. Thank you. Rocío, uh, Rocío Lourdes Pimentel. Present. Very good. Okay, now. Uh, I'm going to send you to work in pairs and I want you to do two things. Okay. First thing, I want you to write um, six questions from these two paragraphs, three and three. Three and three, just no questions, okay? From this paragraph. Yeah? Did Miss Mendo Mrs. Mendoza, da, 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 da. did Mr. Torres, da, 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 da. okay? Three questions about Mrs. Mendoza. And three questions about Mr. Torres. And I want you to practice this question and answer, these short conversations. Practice in pairs, okay? Question, answer. Question, answer. Practice in pairs, okay? Okay, so let's go to the groups. Let me stop here sharing. Okay, we're going to work in pairs. See you like in what, 10 minutes. Hi, teacher. Hello. Three questions. Yeah, three questions from for uh, from Mrs. Mendoza's text. 
And three questions from Mr. Torres. Six questions in total. Okay. Did he solve the problem? Mauricio, you got it. Hi. Yes. Did not did she wear? Um, you better use you better use the names. Did Miss Mendoza um, broke a piece? Miss Mendoza broke. Is not. No. No. The... No, she didn't. Is there? Hay que responder con el con el auxiliar o o o no se broke. Amba. No, she didn't. Not okay. The technician broke. Oh, Peter, me quedé sola. Emma, ¿Qué pasó? ¿Con quién? Eh, creo que era Javier, pero no sé si él fue el que dijo en el grupo que tenía problemas eh, por la tormenta. Uno, dos, dos, dos. No, no, no. La voy a mandar con Laura que también está solita. Ok, gracias. Hello, teacher. Hello. Uh, did, what is church? Church. Uh huh. Uh, when they ask you to pay for something. Okay. He he even charged me for a price he broke. Entonces, ahí podría ser did she did she uh, me uh, Mr. Mendoza, did he es la cosa? Did he charge me for a price uh, he broke? Something. It's okay, teacher. 
Repeat, please. Did, did he charge me for a piece of piece of broke? A piece he broke. He broke. Mm -hmm. Yes. Did he charge her? What? Did he charge her? Estamos preguntando si, si le cobró a ella, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Yes, he did. Uh -huh. Vamos a ver otra pregunta. Let me see. Did he did he give a copy of the report? About um también did, did he give? Uh -huh. Did he give? Did he give? Uh, did he give the copy of the report? Teacher. Hello? Es propio usar dos pronombres, o sea, porque formulamos una pregunta, pero tenemos, todavía, yo le, le traté de responder, pero no sé si es lo correcto. A ver. Did he say something to Mr. Mendoza? Who? Who are you talking about? Who is he? The technician. Ah, okay. Okay, better if you write the did the mechanic or the technician say something. Porque to... en la primera pregunta ya usamos en la primera pregunta ya usamos technician. Mm -hmm. Okay. Entonces, si es un hilo. Oh, okay. Por ejemplo, did the technician help to repair the payroll system? Eso es una pregunta. Ok. Uh, entonces, como para darle contexto y no usar otra vez de technician, usamos el he. Ah, ok. Ok. Pero, ¿es correcto usar un dos como dos? Sí, porque tenemos que, tenemos que saber a quién, como complemento, usar un subject. Um, no, sujeto es el... Es el... Es he. Sí, pero, pero por ejemplo, en la cuestión, ¿did he say something to Miss Mendoza? Correcto. Miss Mendoza no funciona ahí como sujeto. Ah, por eso, es funciona, uh -huh. funciona como complemento. Claro. Ah, ok. Sí, claro, no, no hay problema. Ok. Muy bien. La número tres, ¿qué decía? La número tres, ¿did he, did he hear? A copy the report. Did he give a copy the report? Yes, he did. Ahí dice que. Ahí habría que. ¿A quién? ¿A quién se lo dio? Maybe, maybe. De technician a Mr. Mendoza. Ah, entonces, ¿cómo quedaría maybe, la pregunta? Sí, pero quizás ah, como... Did, did the technician give a copy of the report? To Miss Mendoza. Ah, podría ser to Miss Mendoza. 
Ahora, para usarla ella como sujeto principal, pudiéramos decir, did she have a copy of the report? Ok, también. Did she have, or did she receive, uh -huh. did, did she, she get, mm -hmm. did Mrs. Mendoza get, ok, María, mm -hmm. ¿cuál dejamos entonces? Did Miss Mendoza get, a copy of the report. Miss Mendoza. Did Miss Hello Mary. Mary Mary. Mary. Se le oye cortado. Se le salió compañero. No, no le entiendo. Todos los compañeros le... Si sí, no le entiendo. <risa> Quiere escríbame en el chat porque no le entiendo. Ya fue a ver a su papá. Ya salí para que te. Sí, solo. No, no le comprendo, Mary. Uh, sí, solo oigo que dice el final. Y chair. <risa> Me está hablando en chino. ¿Por qué? No, están en, en, en grupos ahorita. Ah. <risa> Y su papá está bien. ¿Usted es la que iba donde su papá? Sí. Ah, bueno. Hoy sí ya me entiende. Un poquito mejor, sí. Yo creo que es la importa y con datos. Ah. Ok. No, ahorita le estoy queriendo dar también. Ahí sí le entendí. Ay, me entendió. Sí. <ríe> Ay, pito. 
Yo no sé qué es, era la señal o el micrófono, pero sí se oye todo cortado. Sí, bien cortada. Bueno, no sé si quieren me espera aquí, voy a ir a ver los demás grupos cómo están sí. o, o la mando a algún grupo. Pero ahorita está comiendo nada más. La mano. Abajo se lo da No me quiero. Oigo, pero todo cortado, entonces no le entiendo. La mando a un grupo. No, pero ahí no se caer en el corte. No. no, hombre, <ríe> qué terrible. Sí, está por la Bueno, estamos en la página treinta y cuatro, ¿verdad? Estamos ahí. Luego a Nada. Hi, teacher. Hello. Teacher, I have a question mm -hmm. uh, uh, for the, the for las preguntas, verdad? Mm -hmm. uh, yo no sé. Yo tengo una, tengo un dudas si son preguntas nada más relacionadas a uh, yes, question yes or no, o hay que colocarle más contexto, por darle un ejemplo, es como eh, el, te gusta el ambiente laboral en el que trabajas o si o decir eh, do, you, do you like the class English do you like eh, no, 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 no. Okay. Entonces, no son yes, no questions about the paragraph of Mrs. Mendoza and Mr. Torres what is the paragraph es en el book, es en la página 33. Entonces las preguntas son con la información que ya usted nos había dado en el libro, ¿verdad? Lo que está en el libro de Mrs. Mendoza y de Mr. Torres. Sacar tres preguntas de cada párrafo. Yes, no questions. Página 34. 33. Ok, perdón. Ah, ok. Sacar tres preguntas de cada párrafo. Yes, no questions. Perfect, teacher, perfect. Thank you. Okay. Lo habíamos hecho diferente. Sí. I have the, the confusion. Estoy durmiendo, teacher. Ya me tomé dos cafés y aún así sigo con sueño. 
Ay, ay, ay. Bueno. See you. See you. Quickly. Quickly. Tres y tres, creo que son, ¿verdad? Tres. Oh, okay. Okay. ok, we finish. Did the technician come to help Mr. Mendoza? ¿Mm? No, no lo escuché. Did the technician come to help Mr. Mendoza? ¿Cuál? Esa es la primera. Yo lo puse diferente. ¿En serio? ¿Cómo lo puse? Yo me recuerdo que dijimos. Um, did, me, did the technician come to help Mr. Mendoza? Ajá, sí, lo dije. En lo que venimos de camino. Hi, teacher. Hello. Finish. <laughs> okay. Tell me. Okay. Um, Do you, Mr. Mendoza, have a problem with the payroll? Yes, he did. He had a problem with the payroll. Okay. 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 Only one little detail. Is Mr. Mendoza or Mrs. Mendoza? Ah, it's Mrs. Mrs. Ah, so Sorry. it's not a he. Que se quiso cambiar de género. <laughs> <laughs> Moderna. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Uh, did the technician come to help you? Yes, he did. He come to help. To help Jacqueline, or to help me, or to help who? To help. Um, Are you Mrs. Mendoza? Yes. <laughs> you are not Mrs. Mendoza. Okay. Mr. Mrs. The, 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 the technician. Come to help, uh, come to help at Mrs. Mendoza. Okay, sing a lot. Mrs. Mendoza, okay, sing a lot. Mrs. Mendoza. O, pudieras de simplemente decir, come to help her. Oh, okay. Porque estamos hablando de Mrs. Mendoza. Ella. Okay. Uh, did he give did he give her a copy of the report? Ah, exacto. Okay, ¿qué hayamos hecho con you? Yes. Yes. He did. He got a copy. A copy here. Está bien así. Mm. Repeat the repeat it, please. La última. Uh, the question or the answer? Yeah, the question. 
Did he give her a copy of the report? Uh -huh. Yes. Yes, he did. He okay. gave a copy here. Yes, he did. He gave a copy. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. Aquí puede decir, he gave her a copy. He gave him, a, he gave her a copy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Did Mr. Torres call for assistance the mechanic? Yes, he did. He had a problem with the car. Did Mr. Torres? No, esa es la respuesta de la, de, de la primera, perdón, yo te refiero que pregunté la segunda, es que la tengo de sorpresa. Te voy a preguntar la primera. Did Mr. Torres have a problem with the car? Yes, he did. He had a problem with the car. Así sí. Ok. Ok. Did Mr. Torres call for assistance, the mechanic? Uh, yes. Ahí cambian el orden. Call the mechanic for assistance. Did call the mechanic. Did Mr. Torres call the mechanic for assistance? Ok, sí, tiene más sentido. Uh, yes, he did. He called for assistance. Mm -hmm. Y la última, did the mechanic is very slow? No, he didn't. The mechanic was, was very fast. Mm. Repeat, repeat again the question, please. Did the mechanic is very slow? No. No, no. he. No, no, no. Porque ahí es una, es, tú estás haciendo una pregunta con el verbo be. ¿Cómo sería una pregunta con el verbo be en pasado? Did the mechanic was very no. slow? No. Olvídate del did. The mechanic is very slow. Eso es presente. <laughs> ayer lo vimos, lo que vimos ayer. No me juzgue. <laughs> Uh, didn't the mechanic was no. Is, no, I. Ayer vimos eso. Yes, no questions with was or where. Is was. Ajá, uh -huh, ¿cómo? This was the mechanic very slow. Pero no me uses is was. Mm. Was the mechanic. Ajá. Uh -huh. Very slow. Ajá. Uh -huh. So I respond, no, he wasn't. Uh -huh. He is very fast. He was. He was very fast. Very fast. Okay. Okay, it's time to stop the meeting, the breakout room. See you later, okay? See you.
Teacher, cats and dogs again in Santa Ana. Really? I hey, am. I am. Oh, very hard. <laughs> we sleep tonight with a perfect clean. Yeah. Hey. It is not raining here. Wow. Applause to my partner. <laughs> I okay, I like to hear some of your questions, okay? Voy a pedir a cada uno que me lea una pregunta y no la repitan, okay? O sea, no no se vale repetir. Okay, empecemos con eh, Frida. Read one of your questions, please. Um, okay. Did Mr. Mendoza solve, solve the payroll? Solve or solved? Solved the payroll. Oh, are you sure, Frida? I don't know. Yeah, my soul left. <laughs> How must be, how is the verb in questions? ¿Cómo debe estar el verbo en las preguntas? Eh, let me think. Eh, eh, subject, verb, base form, and ah. complement. Ah, okay, base form. Entonces, ah. did Mr. Mendoza solve the payroll? Ah, okay. No, not solved it. Okay, correct. Good. Uh, Jonathan? Sorry, teacher. I One don't, I, I didn't request the question because uh, electricity power is down oh. for the rain. But you are not down. You have I the just, energy. I just, <laughs> I just come back. Okay. Javier? Where are you, Javier? I see that your camera is on, but uh, it's completely dark. Sorry, teacher. <laughs> you have a question? Um, yep. Can you read it? Um, yeah. <laughs> um, no, I don't know. Uh, the, the first part of the first part or the second part of whatever so okay um um did you give a detail of the problem to mr torres did you nah. uh, está malo. <laughs> está malo. Uh, de quién estás hablando de mr torres did no, mr la... torres uh -huh. Did Mr. Torres keep a detail of the problem uh, report? A quien, a quien? O sea, no sé, lo que quiero decir es como que si le dieron a detalle el problema a Mr. Torres. Ah, entonces, ¿quién le tenía que dar el detalle el del problema? Ah, entonces. Did you? No, no take... fui yo, no fui yo. Uh, ¿De quién estamos hablando? Del technician. El técnico. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. The technical uh, give a detail of the problem to Mr. Torres. Ah, okay. Okay. Good. Did the technician? Bueno, que no era un technician, era un mechanic. Okay. Did the mechanic give details about the incident to Mr. Torres? Yes, he did. Okay, Mauricio. <laughs> <laughs> One question, Mauricio. Did the motor of car Mr. Torres start? Okay, tal vez el orden nada más. Did 
Aquí tendríamos que usar un possessive. Did Mr. Torres cars engine? Esa es la engine. palabra para motor. Engine. Okay. Did Mr. Torres cars Did Mr. Torres car engine, engine start? start? Yes. ¿Cómo sería la respuesta? Yes, it did. The motor started fine. Yes. It. It. Ah, ok, perfecto. Yes, it did. Excellent. Ok, Jacqueline. One question. Did the technician come to help? To help a quien? Mrs. Mendoza. Mrs. Mendoza. Ah, okay. Good. Thank you. Wendy. Okay. Um, did Mr. Mendoza understand the copy of the re report? Ah, okay. Okay. Good. What is the answer? No, she didn't. No, she didn't. Perfect. Thank you. Arnoldo. Did the technician say something to Miss Mendoza? No, he didn't. Ah, okay. Good. Mm, good. Zaira? Tal, tal, tal vez sería eh, Arnold aclarar ahí que fue el primer technician, ¿verdad? Porque después el otro sí le ayudó. Just. Ya, yeah. entonces, eh, maybe this the first technician. Exacto. Uh -huh. Ok. Perfect. Saira. Okay. Yes, teacher. One question. Uh, did Mr. Torres receive assistance? Ok. The answer. The answer. Yes, he did, and everything was perfect. Okay, good. Thank you. Laura. Uh, did Mr. Torres have a problem with the car engine? Engine. Okay. Engine, uh-huh. Yes, he did. Yes, he did, perfect. Rocío. Um, did the technician give a copy of the report to Mrs. Mendoza? Uh, yes, he did. Ah, okay. Mm, actually, no, he didn't. Mm. Oh no 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 yes he gave a yes, he gave yes. a copy but she didn't understand it okay you're right yes uh, Galileo Galileo yes sir one question uh, yeah did the technical solve the problem yes he did but he didn't say anything to Mr Mendoza. Okay. Um, good, very good. Just remember, people, it's Mrs. Mendoza. Mrs. Yes. Yeah, it's a lady. It's a lady. Uh, okay, Mrs. Okay, uh, Nalilian. Este. <laughs> What the mechanic uh, was rude to Mr. Torres? Uh, 
no didn't. And... <risa> no, hay que revisar esa pregunta. Deben de que comenzar con did. Y luego lo demás. Revísela, revísela. Atienda al bebé y luego revisamos. Dinora. Did Mrs. Mendoza broke a piece? Break a piece? Okay. The answer? No, she didn't. Okay, good. Ivania? Uh, did he say something for Mrs. Mendoza? No, he didn't. Okay. The, cuando dice he, se refiere al technician, ¿verdad? Entonces, pero bueno, yeah. estamos bien. Uh, ¿Con quién vamos? Karen. Call the technician for assistance. Okay. Good. And the answer? Yes, he did. He called the mechanic for assistance. Okay. Good. Myra? Yes, he gave detail about the incident. Eso no es pregunta. Eso no es pregunta. ¿Cómo comienza la pregunta, Mayra? Did. Ah, yo escuché yes, no did. No, Repeat. Did. Mayra, did. Ah, Se vale. la voy a decir otra vez, teacher. Yes, yes, please. Did. He gave details about the incident. Ah, ok, ok, ok. No. Sí, es Perfect. la pregunta. <laughs> yes, es la pregunta. Ok. Catherine. Um, did the mechanic resolve the problem late and slowly? No, he didn't. He was so quickly. Ah, ok. So quick. So quick. Okay. Quick or fast. Ok. Cualquiera de dos. Ok. Uh, Jonathan dijo que porque no tenía luz no lo pudo hacer. Como dicen la vieja confiable. No. <ríe> eh, Catherine ya pasó. Jacqueline. Ya pasó Jacqueline. Como me apagan la cámara. No sé si ya pasaron. No, ¿verdad? Ya pasé. Ya pasó. Sí. Va, pues le voy a creer. <ríe> Ok, eh, Catherine también y Mary se acaba de integrar. Ok, very good. So, hay que estar claros ahí en quién está preguntando, ¿verdad? Y, y la respuesta, pero la mayoría lo hizo muy bien, muy bien. Um, voy a dejar, porque ya se nos fue el tiempo, unas preguntas para que las respondan y mañana trabajamos en parejas con esto. Déjenme um, si sí, esto es. Ok, la voy a poner ahí en el WhatsApp. Es un cuadrito donde están, ya se lo voy a mostrar. Ok, es este cuadro. Acá yo les he dado las preguntas. Lo que vamos a hacer es practicar mañana. ¿verdad? Pregunta, respuesta, pregunta, respuesta entre ustedes. Y quiero eh, que pongan información real. Aquí les he puesto yo mis respuestas a cada pregunta. Por ejemplo, 
were you in your current job five years ago? No, I wasn't. I was in another company. ¿Verdad? La primera. The second question. Como ven, aquí estamos usando ya yes, no questions with was, where, y yes, no questions with did. No hay que revolver las cosas. ¿Verdad? Cuando usamos was or where, no vamos a usar did. Y cuando usamos did, no vamos a usar por lo menos al inicio de la pregunta, was or where. Ok. Eh, veamos. Were you late to your English class yesterday? No, I wasn't. I was on time. Algunos mm, sí están tarde, ¿va? pero bueno. Vamos a ver qué tan honestos son. Eh, was your last vacation exciting or boring? My case, it was boring. I was at home all the time. Uh, was your lunch delicious today? Yes, it was. I ate beef steak with rice. Did you have a pet when you were a child? Yes, I did. It was a dog and its name was Perla. Did you get your COVID vaccine already? Your, okay, me come now. Did you get your COVID vaccine already? Yes, I did. I got the two doses already. Did you eat pupusas last week? Yes, I did. I ate pupusas on Thursday. Did you have a boyfriend? ¿Verdad? Para los varones. O girlfriend. No, al revés, perdón. <laughs> boyfriend para las chicas. O girlfriend para los varones. When you were in high school. Miren mi respuesta. Qué honesto. No, I didn't. I had a girlfriend after high school. No in high school, but after high school. Ok. Entonces, acá... Ven en el cuadro que dice you, que van a poner ustedes su respuesta, ¿verdad? Y mañana van a entrevistar a algún compañero y le van a hacer las preguntas y van a escribir la respuesta de su compañero. Y su compañero le va a preguntar a ustedes y ustedes van a escribir la ellos van a escribir la respuesta de ustedes. Alguien me ha escrito en el chat. Okay, okay. Okay, people. Entonces, hola. Entonces a mi pregunta le faltaba agregarle did. Did mechanic. Para decir que si el mecánico fue rudo. No, esa no sería una pregunta con did. Esa sería una pregunta con was. Ahí tendría que decir, was the mechanic rude? Sí. ¿Eh? Porque está usando fue, el, el verbo to be, que es was. Yes. Cuando usamos was o where, no vamos a usar did. Okay. ¿Ya? Was the mechanic rude? No, he wasn't. O oh, yes, he was. Mm. Ok. Thank you. Ok, people, vamos a la última asistencia del de día. ¿Está claro lo que van a hacer acá? Practiquen respondiendo sus, eh, escri uh, anotando sus propias sus perso sus respuestas personales. Mañana van a entrevistar a alguien, ¿verdad? Y le van a hacer esas preguntas. Así ya tienen ustedes lista su respuesta. ¿Verdad? La idea va a ser practicar pregunta, respuesta, ¿no? Ok. Um, Ana Lilian Reyes. Present, teacher. Ok, thank you. Have a good night, Ana Lilian. A ver, déjenme dejar de compartir acá para poder verles. Ok, muy bien. Thank you for attending, Ana Lilian. Brian Javier Carmona. Se nos fue. Eh, Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, thank you for coming, for attending. See you tomorrow. 
Frida Janine Mejia. Present teacher. Thank you, Frida, for attending. See you tomorrow. Eh, Guillermo Antonio Garcia. No. Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Okay, thank you for attending. Good night. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Jose Arnoldo. Bueno, este Arnoldo ya nos está dando la fuga temprano todos los días. Y, y Dinora le dije good night, pero no, con usted nos quedamos, ¿verdad? Yeah, teacher. Okay, sí, no, no voy a ir. Teacher me dijo good night. No. <laughs> Ok, eh, José Galileo Barrera. Present, good night, everybody. Thank you and good night. José Jonathan Vigil. Present. Thank you, Jonathan, good and night. good night. José Rodrigo Hernández. No, Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present, teacher. Ok, thank you for attending and good night. Bye. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present, teacher. Thank you for attending, Laura. See you tomorrow. Yes, see you tomorrow. Maria Concepcion Ceron. Mary. Tenemos ahí problemas de micrófono, pero por ahí anda. Eh, Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Okay, Ivania. Thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Ah, está Concepción, como que es robotito. Mauricio Antonio Rivera, Dean Schwab, Mayra Veralice Moreno. Ok, Mayra, thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Um, Zaira Marlene Larín. Present teacher. Okay, Good night. Zaira. Good night. Uh, Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Good okay. night. Good night, Wendy. Blessing, Blessings. everybody. Jacqueline Glorivel Rivas. Present. Good night. Thank you for attending, Jacqueline. Good night. Eh, Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Ok, Karen. Have a good night. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Ok, Mauricio. Thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. And Rocío Lourdes Pimentel. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night, Rocio. Thank you for attending. Okay, Dinora, how can I help you? What would you like to review or reinforce? Or tell me. You? I don't know. I'm I'm okay with the with the themes. Okay, yeah, yes, I see that you that you get it. Okay, let's talk a little bit. Okay. And let's practice these questions and answers that you are going to that I gave you at the end of the class. All okay. right. Yeah. All right. Okay, this one. Tell me, um, Dinora, were you in your current job five years ago? No, I wasn't. Uh, I was in another company that the name is De Casa. De Casa? Yeah. Oh, Casa. that's a big company. Yeah. Yeah, and, and what were you doing there? I was import manager. Really? Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's a very nice position. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, and now, where are you now? Uh, import manager too. At where? Papa John Pizza. Ah, oh, you are with Galileo. Yeah. Okay. Very nice. Yes, <laughs> But you look very, very young. Yeah, I I am twenty six. 
years old. Oh, oh, okay, but you look younger than that. Yeah, a little <laughs> girl. <laughs> very good, very good. I don't use a lot of makeup. Ah, you think that's that's the reason? I guess. <laughs> because when I when I use makeup, I look like a bigger. You look older. Older, yeah. Older. Ah, okay, okay. Um. Okay. Now, and were you late to your English class yesterday? No, I wasn't. I was <laughs> on time every day. <clears throat> okay. Was your last vacation exciting or boring? My last vacation... Uh, was exciting. Uh, I was go to the beach. I'm sorry. I went to the beach. Ah, okay. And what with my what? family and my friends? Ah. What beach did you go to? Uh, Costa Azul. Ah, that's a beautiful beach. Yes. Ah, to a, a a beach house. Yeah, we. We were renting a beach house. Ah, okay. Excellent. Very good. Um, was your lunch delicious today? Yes, it was. I ate beef, beef steak, and with vegetable and cheese and a bottle of water. Wow, okay. Kind of like me, you no, know, a little bit. Okay. So you don't need too much pizza, do you? I I used to eat <laughs> a lot of pizza, but uh, Okay, how long have you been working at Papa John's? Two years ago, two and a half years ago. Two and a half years, ah, okay. So you have free pizza or not? Yeah. Wow, yeah. you're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> you're lucky because this is delicious. I like Papa John's. Okay. Now, did you have a pet when you were a child? No, I didn't. Really? Yeah, oh. I didn't have any pet on yeah. my life. Not a bird, not a dog, or a cat, nothing. No, nothing. And now? I want, but not. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you get your COVID vaccine already? Yes, I did. Okay. I got only one. Ah. Only one dose okay. already. And the second one I will get on August 4th. So ah, okay. Vacation. Okay, that's good. That's good. <clears throat> Did you eat pupusa last week? Last week? Yes. Yes, uh, I did. Maybe uh, I... <laughs> I ate pupusas. Um... Twice a week. Oh, okay. Yeah. For breakfast or for dinner? For dinner. Nah, perfect. Okay. How many pupusas do you eat? 
Mm, only two. Only two? Yeah. Ah. <laughs> For the diet. <laughs> okay, good. <clears throat> Did you have a boyfriend when you were in high school? Yeah. Oh. I have. I have a boyfriend, my first boyfriend. Ah, okay. When I was 15 in the high school. Oh, 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 oh very early. <laughs> ah, very early. My first love. <laughs> and where, where did you study your high school? I studied at Colegio Santa Inés. Oh, Santa Tecla. Yes. You live in Santa Tecla? Yes. Oh, where? In La Sabana, aquí en Ciudad Merliot. Ah, I used to live in La Sabana when, like, more than 25 years ago. Yes. Almost in... my... <laughs> Your age? My age. Uh -huh. <laughs> Maybe more, more than 25, because my older daughter, my oldest daughter is, how old is she? She's 28. Yeah, and we didn't have any children by that time, any child. So it may be more than 20 years ago, 25, 27, 28 years ago, something like that. But we lived in the third, uh, um, how can I say? The third part, Savannah 3. Yeah, I live in the... Really? Savannah 3? Yeah. Savannah three? Oh. yeah. When the... Los pasajes son uh -huh. letters. Yes. Our letters. Yeah. I live in Senda D. Senda D. Senda D. I don't remember. Um, let me think. It is no, no. no. I don't remember how many how many uh pasajes are there only a b c d a b a to f f a is in f. the park maybe i lived in e maybe because i remember we were close to the park close to the park the is the F? No, the but maybe. not not exactly in the park. So, yeah, but after the hill, después de la cuesta. Mm -hmm. Ah, you know. okay. See, si. yeah, long, long time ago. Yeah, <laughs> we used to be neighbors. Maybe you were, <laughs> you weren't born yet. <laughs> <laughs> or your family has always lived there? Yeah, my family, yes. Oh, maybe I met your family, but I don't remember. Yeah, Alfaro. maybe. Alfaro, yeah. Alfaro. <laughs> but we live there only one year or one year and a half, I think. Yeah, yeah and right now you, where do you live? Uh, here in Lourdes. Oh. I live here in Lourdes. Yeah. So, interesting. Interesting. Okay, thank you for staying for your personal session, Dinora. It's been nice talking to you. Thank you to you, teacher. Okay, hey, my pleasure. Okay, have a good night. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Bye. bye bye. Take care.